In this video, I'm going to show you how you can configure or set up Hostinger SMTP so you can send your bulk emails. Okay. At the end of this video, I'm going to give you an advice and that advice is a top-notch advice. So stick around. Okay. If you are ready, get some cup of cocoa and let's move on. So there are two strategies that we can use to configure or set up hosting guy SMTP. One is to have a hosting plan with SM uh, with hosting sorry, and two you subscribe to their email plan. Okay, so now so when you visit hostinger.com, so I'll leave the link at the description down below and also at the first comment so you check it out okay now before we continue please kindly subscribe because i upload video every two days okay kindly subscribe website development email marketing affiliate marketing making passive money online is what we create over here so kindly subscribe okay so you don't miss anything at all so that is it so you visit hostinger.com now we have the hosting and you have the email so in this video i am going to use the hosting but when 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 you use the email section you can still follow along it is very simple just uh stick around okay so when i click on this email we have go you have google workspace email hosting and you have the titan email hosting so i'm going to use the titan email hosting okay so just click on that okay so you can see this is the plan okay so with a 99 cent you can have it for a month and this we have two um 2.99 cent and you can also have it for a month okay just that with this you have 10 gig of email storage and with this you are going to have 30 gig of email storage that is it so you can when you're ready you just click on add to cart then any of them just click on add to cart follow with your information just with your credit card or whatever just make a payment and that is all okay now if you are having a hosting with hosting app you are going to follow from here okay so that is it so as i told you just fill in the information this you can use credit card PayPal, google pay you can use alipay and con gate okay so you can use any of them make your payment and you are you are true okay so that's all so let me go back so if you are having a hosting plan with hosting app then you don't have to pay for email anymore do you understand you can get a free email service that is it so you have to just click on hosting or uh, if if you want to use hosting guest um hosting plan you just click on hosting so when you click on hosting you just click on web hosting if you want to use their hosting plan to access the email so that you can still create your website then you have to use the web hosting okay that is all so in, in this case uh, i've already i already have um, a hosting plan with hostinger so i'm just going to log in before we are able to create our smtp with hostinger we need to have a domain name okay this is the whole scenario we are going to host the email on our domain do you understand so when someone wants to send us email the person can send us email using our domain extension so you have something like support at our domain.com or maybe info at domain.com our domain so whatever name you choose at our domain.com and that's a business email a professional business email and with that you are being trusted a lot okay so when you send out your services to someone they see your business email they then see that you are a very serious person you understand they, they trust you with a business email so we need to first go and buy a domain if you already have a domain just you can skip this part okay so in this video i'm going to show you how you can buy a domain so you just click on domains okay click on get a new domain okay so you just type in whatever you want let's say i want SaaS media gh search so it is available just click on buy okay so you can choose the three years two years or one year plan okay so let's say i want a one year plan uh, you, you can choose your payment method so I you can click on change to you to change your uh, payment method uh, so that's all or if you want to use the same payment method all you have to do is just click on continue okay so so if let's say i want to change my payment gateways i can use visa paper g 
the Google Pay, I can use Alipay. So I'm going back. I'm going back. So that is also, or you just have to click on. So let, let's go back again. So you just have to click on purchase or continue and you can buy your domain. So if you have been able to purchase your domain, come to click on domains. Okay, then you have to select your domain, which is SAS class. I'm going to use this domain, SAS class dot click. Okay, I'm going to click on that. So now, before we can create a free SMTP with hosting, uh, we need to connect our domain to the hosting plan that we have. Okay, so if you don't have a hosting plan, you can go directly to their email services. Do you understand? As I told you in this video, I'm going to focus more on the hosting plan but they are all the same okay so just click on connect your website to your hosting plan so you are going to connect your domain to your hosting plan so that means you need to create a website okay that's very simple it's not going to develop or something like that you just have, you have to install something on the domain that's all so i'm going to click on connect website to the hosting plan then have to click here and click on sapi tech okay this is the name of the hosting plan so I click continue so I can migrate my website if I already have existing website somewhere I can just migrate it here in this case I'm just going to create any website at all okay just the purpose of this video we want SMTP do you understand so if you want to learn how to create a website just leave it at the comment section anything that you want to learn you want to ask concerning website development leave it at the comment section affiliate marketing leave it at the comment section business and marketing at the comment section also making passive money online leave it at the comment section I'm going to I'll make a video on whatever you request do you understand so you just click on create a new website okay so in this case i'm going to use wordpress you can use a, the other one that's your own cup of tea you have to type in your password over here so i'm going to use this as my password click on continue okay i'm going to skip the plugins for later in case if i want to build a website i can do it on wordpress itself so i'm going to, going to click on that okay so i'm going to skip this as well so in this section, make sure your domain that you are going to use to create your free SMTP, I mean your email SMTP, you have to select it over here. Make sure it is selected over here. Okay, so what I'm going to use is SAS class dot click. So it's selected. So click on select. Okay, so let's wait for our website to install on our domain. Okay, so that is it. So we have to just click on manage site. We are going to our control panel. Okay, just click on manage site over here. Okay, okay. So as you can see, we have free email over here. So just click on manage. Okay, on the under the free email, just click on manage. Okay, so as you can see, we have the business email. We have the free email. Just click on one. Okay, so with the so let's go through their plan with their free email so we have up to one gigabyte of email storage per one account so when you create dozen account every account that you create you have one gig of storage you understand and with the business you have 10 so you have the read receipt and we have the email template okay and here you don't have any email template over here we have send later follow up reminder send us our alias okay so that's all so that's the that's the only difference if you don't care about any of these no that's all just click on select the free but if you care about it you have to choose the business plan but in this video i'm focusing on the free email just click on that and because we are creating an smtp so you can use to send bulk emails using a different uh, software do you understand so that is all if you want to learn how to send bulk emails okay so i've created a video okay under the description i use hosting smtp so you can just go and watch that video and you get a whole idea of how to send bulk emails using hosting smtp okay so now this is it so we are going to create our email account so you have to type in anything that you want over here so you can see it's at our domain dot our domain okay my advice is when you are creating an email account, make sure you use a dot com domain. Don't use dot click domain. Don't use a dot com domain. So that's so, so I'm going to just type in support over here. So my domain will be support at sasclass.click. Okay. 
So that is all. I'm going to type in my password over here. You can just mark this for automatic password generation, okay? But in this case, I already have my password. I'm going to just paste it over here. Then I'm going to click on create a new account. So we are done. So this is the link to our webmail. This is our email and this is our password. So I'm just going to copy this. I'm going to, just going to copy this. And copy my email as well. I'm going to copy, click on show to copy my password. Or just click on copy to copy the password. And that's all. So we are done. So we can access webmail using hosting yes SMTP or hosting yes email account. Okay. So I've created a video on how to send emails using webmail. So I'll leave the link at the description down below. You just have to check it out. Okay. So when I click on access webmail, I am going to be redirected to webmail. Okay. So this is my email and the password I created, just paste it over here. So I've entered my email and I've entered my password. Just click on login if you have done so. So you can just click on I'll do it later. Now, this is the point. If you want to set a recovery email, so you can use your Gmail to set a recovery email. So in case you lose your password for your hosting your SMTP, you just have to um, you just reset it. You are going to use your email to reset it. Okay. Uh, so that is all. So I'm going to click on I'll do it later. So this is how it looks like. Okay, so I've told you I've created a video on how to use webmail. Okay, so you can check it out at the description down below. Now, I'm going to show you how you can get your SMTP details. If you want to send out emails using a different or a third party software or app, you have to, you, have, you need to have your SMTP details. Okay, so let's go back. Okay, click on done over here. So this is our email account. So all you have to do is just click on emails over here. So you select your domain, you go and look for it. I'm going to click next. Uh, so this is my domain. I'm going to click on manage. Okay. So that the domain you use in creating your email account, you are just going to. You can only send up to 100 emails, just 100. But with Gmail's SMT, we can send up to 500 emails at once. You get it? So I would prefer you use uh, Gmail SMTP. But if you want to have access to webmail, then you can use the Hostinger's SMTP. So you get it? SMTP. So that is also this is Gmail's sending limit. You have the free trial, you can send up to 500 emails. So that is it. So if you want to send out bulk emails, okay, I prefer to use the Gmail SMTP. And if you want to find out how to create Gmail SMTP, I'll leave the link at the description down below. You go and check it out. Okay. Any question that you have, leave it at the comment section. Any uh, suggestion you have, leave it at the comment section. Kindly subscribe, like this video. You can buy me a coffee. All the links are at the description and also at some of the comment section, the pinned comment section. Thank you for watching this wonderful video. Let's meet next time. Goodbye.